Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Turbo Slide DX. <laughs> here it's Matt. I'm here with Tammy. Mm. And we're playing this game for the Halloween sometime this year. I don't know when that's going to be. It's something about the 31st. I have no idea. You don't understand how excited I am for him to play this right now. This is one of my absolute favorite games in the whole wide world. I've been trying to get him to play this game since we met. So, Eternal Darkness, Sanity's Requiem? As much as I love my honey, Right now, if you could see his face, he looks pretty tense. I don't like scary games. At all. It took me like a year and a half to beat Dead Space. And that wasn't even scary. <laughs> and I only played when like people came over, because, yeah. Anyway, my fear of scary games isn't so much the game itself. Well, it is. But it's like I'm putting their lives in my hands, and I feel for them, because they're going to die. <laughs> anyway, let's do this. So, the fuck? Would you like to carry this information? No, because I'm not having you cheat. Uh, apparently that was Tammy's information. Flesh. Bone. Sorry if there's like an echo, but she says I have to play this with the sound on, so. Yes. Anybody who's ever played Eternal Darkness knows everything in this game matters when you're playing. The TV's not even that loud. It's like on six and it's fucking like... Well, it's not that high. Listen. I am also dead. This is not my fucking day. This is important. It is the story of humanity. How do you tell a story when you're dead? Like it or not, believe it or not, as you will. Your perceptions will not change reality, but simply color it. Humanity has been on the edge of extinction for two millennia. Ignorant of so much and dependent on so few. Guardians grow restless. The fuck am I looking at? Once again, it's the book. Near. What is that? That's a book. It's made of human flesh. My family has crossed their path, and they didn't take kindly to it. This is gay. One out of ten. Their attention turns to my. <laughs> you try to turn it off this early, just because you're scared. And the last hope for humanity. I don't even know what to expect. I should know exactly what this story is about right now. Uh huh. I'm about, to, I'm about to. What the fuck? She has a shotgun. Hey, look at all those monsters in Yo, the room. Yo, stop with playing! <laughs> stop playing! How do I do this? Shoot them! Oh, oh, with B? B yeah. Should shoot. Oh. oh. How, how? Shoot them. Oh, you gotta like aim at their. Yeah. Yo, he just like he was like suck my dick. And while you're playing too, notice how it's targeting their chests. Yeah. You could char target other parts of the body. Yo, he came out of nowhere. How do, you, how do you switch parts of the body? Up and down. Oh, oh you oh. ran out. They're gonna kill you. Yo, stop playing. You fucked up. I didn't fuck up. You fucked up? No, I didn't. Look, my nigga's about to save me. I'm trying to say I fucked up. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Remember the time. 3.33. Good. Oh, she's got kittens on her wall. I never noticed that growing up. Hello. Hey, look, it's home. Uh, was this like a rejected yeah, like 64 this? game or something? Like, it was pretty bad. No, it's pretty good. It didn't age well with graphics, but it's still a really, really good game. There's plenty of GameCube games out there look better. I'll be on the next flight out. Bullshit. There's no way to put subtitles on? No. That's not an option at no. all? No subtitles? Nope. Okay. Don't pay attention to the game. <clears throat> ah, Miss Roybus, I'm pleased to meet you. Trust you had a pleasant trip? Um, yes, I suppose so. Considering. Didn't even dress for the occasion. My condolences. This is this most unpleasant. She came in the middle of the night. It's a shame couldn't read under writer's circumstances. Yes, yes. Can we get this over the please? Of course. This way. But I must warn you. It's not a pleasant sight. Feces everywhere. I'm afraid there's not much to see. <laughs> the fuck? Pre-rendered bullshit. You're just trying to make yourself less scared. Is that your grandfather? Yes. She knew by the ring? Did you even bother looking Wait. at him? I knew it. I don't know. 
understand. Why are you showing me this? Can't you check dental records or something? What's wrong with you? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. It's my job, lady. You're the only living relative, and no, we can't check dental records. There's no way. Oh, none of this makes sense. There's no sign of intrusion, and there was certainly a lot of force. I have never seen anything like this in my 20 years on the force. We have no evidence except for the body, and what's left doesn't say much. I have a feeling we're never going to get to the end of this game with you. How long is this? It's not a long game. I don't think you'll be able to sit through all of it. There must be some clue in this old mansion revealing what happened. I want answers. So do I. He got hungry and started eating himself. <laughs> Shocked by her grandpa's mysterious death and frustrated at the incompetence of the local police, Alex vows to uncover the truth. She decides to search the mansion, the place where... Let's press down. Oh, you have to actually scroll. You have to actually scroll. Uh, the place where Edward constructed his research. If there was a tie to this past and possibly tied to a murder, it would be here. What the fuck? Mansion? Why? Go home. It's her grandpa's home. He's this, dead, so technically it's hers now. Does this all happen, like, within this night? Yeah. Oh, it's one of these, like, you stay in the same spot the whole game, and you just kind of... Oh, like... no. All right. Yeah, but... Yeah. Open. Yeah. How do you open shit? B, open the door. Uh. <laughs> You're in the kitchen. The fuck is that? The pantry. No, you don't hear that? Hear what? It was like creaking noises. Uh-huh. There's someone breathing oh, in there. Oh, fire. What the fuck? <laughs> no! Oh, shit. Why am I playing this? Open the fridge. Yo, it's not playing. Can you open the fridge? No, you can't open the fridge. I can punch it. Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah. PewDiePie, bro. Well, you're in the kitchen. I, I, the, I don't... What does the detective do? Why, can't, why didn't he come Well, this here? is two weeks later. Oh, it's two weeks later? Yeah, it said oh. it. I have um, to pay more attention. You could exit through that door, too. Oh, my God. It's one of these games. Well, so that door is this... That's the least of the kitchen, right? That one? Yeah. When you hit B, it you could... They oh. give you details. Oh, okay. I'm not, I'm not used to pressing B to, like, confirm. That's so weird. It's an older style. No, it's not. No one uses B besides Nintendo. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Ooh, you hear that? I didn't hear shit. Stop playing. You're going back into the kitchen. Oh, uh, fine. I'm safe here. There's a reason why the kitchen has two doors later on. Oh, my God. Shut up. <laughs> Go through the big doors, honey. Oh, my God. Eternal Darkness, part one. That's it. At least the sun's out. The grand piano stands here waiting in the hands of a decent musician. Unfortunately, Edward never really lived up to his description as such. Oh my god. You, you, oh, there's reasons why there's certain things in the house. Shut up. Stop telling me stuff. You'll love it. No, shut up. Shut up. I'm just going to play the game and be surprised like everybody else. Okay. God, there's a reason. Shut the fuck up. There's a reason for everything in this game. Even those tiny little pictures. Yeah, I know. Those are the fucking, like, factions you can go through, whatever, right? Mm-hmm. And the one I would suggest for you starting would be the red one. Don't you only get to choose one like, per game? Yep. Yeah, I'm not playing this game multiple times. Fuck that. Well, that's why I said the red one. I have reason. Method for my madness. Oh, my God. And I see, like, the recording in the corner of my eye, so I keep thinking, like, other shit's happening. <laughs> the fuck's talking to me? Stop! Well... <laughs> oh, look at her way her body, like, hers. <laughs> well, do you want me to blow something for you, or not really? Oh, you can, like, selectively, like, sneak around. Okay. Well, that won't help you. But the red, green, and blue... Because you're not playing through multiple times, I have the Manta Rock one, which is purple. Oh, mm. you hear that? Someone's talking to you. No. Yes. No. They just called your name. I didn't hear it. But, um. Oh, shit. Just wait till you have to 
It's four. Why can't you play this and like me watch you like usual? Because I need you to man up, honey. I I'm man enough. I pay the fucking bills. We have two cars. Look at the, look at the family tree, at least, honey. Oh, look yeah. at the family, tree, the family tree on the mantle. Go sh left, left, left. Examine. Damn, man up, fuck. I've been paying the bills for the past fucking four years. I do too. BS. Uh, well, oh, I'm sorry. Who pays the rent? This nigga. Me. Look carefully at the family tree. Someone being hung. Yes. No one thought this was weird when they like. It First says off. that it holds some secrets. Oh, God. Um, in that room up there is the observatory. <laughs> Every time they talk to me. Does it do that throughout the whole game? It's like... Oh, it does worse shit. But um, while you're playing the game, I would choose the red for you because the red god protects your health more. The blue god protects your magic. I think I'm going to start reading those from now on, like, out loud. You're going to read them out loud? Soaring through the books, Alice sees one that seems to be placed differently than all the others, as if drawing attention to itself. Curious, she examines it. Upon the inside cover, shaky handwriting shapes in the numbers 3 to 3. She replaces the book. Oh! Keep... Was that a good what thing? Was that a good chime? That's a good chime. <laughs> that means you've remembered something. Or found something important. Well, that's when they woke her ass up. You could go to the left. Well, babe, I'm examining stuff. You're examining? The books in the corner seem to focus on the supernatural. The writings of Poe, Lovecraft, the poetry of Blake, the art of Boshk. Boshk. Bosch. Boshk. Everything with a tide hit. Ethereal? Ether Ethereal? Ethereal. Oh. Ethereal horror uh, or fantasy. I'm not the best English person. So. The, I'm not the best English person. <laughs> <laughs> it is all here. A reference library to the arcane. What's this? Alex's grandfather's secret hobby. I are no good at the English. I am Weasel. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, okay. Tell me this, though. When does shit start attacking me? No. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. No, go, re go, go play with the clock, honey. Go play with the clock. Can't even, like... There's nothing there yet. Is that Grandma? I don't think that's grandma. Is that grandma? That's grandma. Oh, it's about to be midnight. Or... No, the sun was just out. Hey, hey. Ooh, read that. Oh. Can you enter room with a... Should Alex adjust the clock? Yes. So, 333. Mm-hmm. Woo! See, they're talking to you more. All right, well, we were like at 12, 13 minutes. Oh, 13, what a good number <laughs> to stop on. Okay, anyway, guys, see you next time. Turbo Slide DS, rate, comment, you know, subscribe. You know, fuck Tammy and her making me play this. <laughs> Wait for Matt to start screaming like a baby. I'll be so happy. Wait, what is this? Oh, she squares up. <laughs> fight me, homie. <laughs> She's like, fight me, bitch. All right, Z. All right, so... You're fine. Trust all right, me. Alright, alright. Thank you for joining us. Bye. <laughs> You'll survive. Oh, god damn it. Hopefully. Oh. Really? Out of everything that could get you?